Ready to help women who are going through tough times will open next month. The Dream Center is a nonprofit with a national reach and provides opportunities for people to rebuild and transform their lives. Right now, there's a facility dedicated to helping men, and in just a few weeks, women will get the benefit as well. Today, 12 News reporter Kayla Shote got a sneak peek inside the Dream Center for women. The Dream Center of Southeast Texas will be welcoming six women into its facility at the former Outprice Juvenile Correctional Facility on December 7th. They are on a mission to help these women build better lives, and they plan to help more women. But in order to do that, they first need your help. We need mattresses, we need rugs, we need the wardrobes to make it look homey for them. A fresh start isn't easy, and the Dream Center of Southeast Texas hopes to give 24 women a chance to start over right here. They will have their own bunk with a desk and share communal living space like a day room and break room. The Dream Center promises to offer the tools and education participants need to get back on their feet. Everything is free to them, so they're not allowed to have outside work because we want them to concentrate on who they are and just getting themselves back, getting themselves healthy, mind, body, spirits. There are 84 Dream Centers around the globe. Mike and Velma Connors met working at a Los Angeles Dream Center in 2003. They moved to Texas in 2017 and opened a center in Southeast Texas dedicated to helping men in October 2017. When people have um, addictions and life controlling problem, it's usually a lot of chaos in their life. So we want to bring routine uh, back into their lives. So we do have a schedule for them. But they knew there was a missing piece to the puzzle. They wanted a facility dedicated to helping women. And in just a few weeks, their dream will become a reality. Yeah, this past year, I think we've um, really moved forward. Um, we've had our men's recovery program now since for a few years, and we've been trying to uh, open up the women's program for the past year and a half, and it's been difficult. But now we finally got that ready to go. If you want to get involved, head to our website, 12newsnow.com. We have a link to the organization's wish list. In Nederland, Kayla Chote, 12 News.